You guys know I love it when a new European comes over. Kyle Matikovic is leaving his Slovenian come and coming to the NBA. It hasn't been official, but the Pelicans still have part of their mid-level, non-taxpayer mid-level exception. And they could also use the new second round pick rule to sign Karlo Maktakovic to a three to four year mil, three to four year deal. Now, what are you getting with Karlo Maktakovic? What I'm assuming is they looked at the free agency market and they're like, look, the bigs aren't that great. And I understand them. And they looked at Karlo Maktakovic and they probably thought, hey, I would not be surprised if, yeah, it was in their best interest to go out and bring him in because dude this guy has a 40 inch vertical and six foot 11 he can play power forward and center and he's was over in slovenia he this past season he's averaged 15 and a half points seven rebounds two and a half blocks per game for cdvita olympia Le 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 i can't say that but someone tell me down below he was a second round pick in 2022 six foot 11 he's 22 years old and they're currently 2.6 million dollars under the luxury tax with one roster space open so them having most of the non-taxpayer mid-level exception remaining they could also use the new second round pick exception to sign matikovic to a three to four year deal and with matikovic you know he la when he was drafted he was playing for mega he's from bosnia herzegovina and he's a guy that in my opinion he's shown the ability to be a solid big who can play the four or the five he he's not going to be a guy that's going to like you know stretch the floor and knock down threes like he's some animal from there but no but what he's going to provide is athleticism rim running rim protection good rebounding solid frame for a very cheap value that he'll be for being a backup big this year he's technically taking 37 percent from three but he's on a very limited attempt but 63 percent from the field he's, he's been honestly fantastic and if we look in i believe it's euro league I, I guess it's technically euro cup not euro league he's only beaten playing year in the euro cup he's averaging 15 six and you know the three-point shots even hitting harder so it's definitely intriguing to see carlo matikovic get this hype i'm excited to see how he'll fit in there he was drafted alongside ej liddell and dyson daniels and don't get me wrong i, I do like the pelicans they do need to back up big that's kind of something that they've lacked you remember when they had Hernan gomez a few years ago it was really nice but yeah outside of Jonas valanciunas they didn't really the, jeremiah robinson earl cody zeller and cody zeller's been a shell of himself so I think Carlo Matikovic, low cost, high reward. Also, guys, I ate yogurt. Oh my God. So if you made it to the end of the video and you've been noticing this white thing on my lip, I'm eating yogurt. Oh yeah. What am I doing? 